Well, hello again everybody, welcome back. And today we have one out of the naughty bucket, which hopefully won't be going back in. And it's an EVA DPS. So it has twin side bars. We have one operated by the key bitting there. And another one which is operated by the dimples on the side. But luckily enough the dimples on the side are only passive. So we don't have to pick those, we just have to pick these. But being a sidebar and the way it operates makes it feel completely different to a pin tumbler. And we also have false gates. Which make it even worse. So all working, all locked up. Let's give this a try, see if we can get into it, and then have a look inside. So I'm going to start at the back. Moderate tension. And one, we've got to click. Sorry, five, four. We got a couple of clicks. Three. We got a couple. Two. We got a click. And one. We got a click. Right, five, four, I think I dropped a bit, four, three, two, Who's definitely not wanting to set? That was four again. Right. right, that was one. That was a nice click on one. Two. That was a nice click. We've actually got a very slight full set going now. Three. Sort of half hearted click, but it did feel like it went into a gate, so. Four. And two, and we're open. Right, don't want to turn it too far because I think there is a trap pin in here. So, let's get this out of here. And I've not had one of these apart before. see how we get on. I have replaced the pin on the back, the clip, with something a bit easier to get off because that was the one that was on it and the bit snapped off. So a little bit of forethought for a change. Unusual for me I know but there we go. Now how are we going to do this? Right let's see if we can get this clip off. Let's there we go. That 
worked. And I don't know what's inside here, but I know there's two sidebars. So let's try and get my fingers around everything. I don't know if there's anything up in the Bible there. Right, there we go. We've got pins there. Now this side here should have the passive sidebar. <coughs> Is that going to come out? Could do. There we go. We'll have a look at that in a second. Then, what's going to happen if I take this sidebar out? I'm going to cover up where all the pins are. Just in case, don't want things going flying and exploding everywhere. So, will this one just lift out or. Is there any coming out? There we go. And we have a little spring on there. So that's the sidebar. Then... Right. Feels like we have springs down here. So... One, two, three, four, and five. And we've got little springs in there. Little tiny springs. and try and get them out so I don't lose them elsewhere. There's that one. One more, which is there. Right, there we go. So I think that's everything out of there. was nerve-wracking <coughs> and let's see if you, what if right we've got there's a pin there which seems to be stuck in there and if we can see that there we go I think that is the trap pin so if we turn it too far the call would actually lock up in there so let's have a look at the passive sidebar. As you can see there. And if we'll stay focused. Are we the right way round? Yes. Focus, come on. As you can see, those match up with that bit on there. So that's why it's just passive. Then on these pins what do we have let's have a look so that is the part of the pin that we actually pick the little lug on the back there on the side that is what's operating or on the spring and look there that is the point where the sidebar locates into which we can see like so if it will focus come on not 
focusing. Let's try. There we go. So those. And that's what allows the sidebar to come in and the core to turn. And anything else? If we actually look at this one, we can see slightly better the full skates. So you can drop into that shallower one, but it won't open. You have to get into the deep ones each time. And some of the full skates are deeper and shallower than others. So, anyway, I'm glad that's over and done with. Uh, Eva DPS, the first thing like that I've ever picked or gutted and luckily enough it didn't go too badly so thanks for watching and I'll see you again soon bye